Hello everyone and welcome back. Uh, today I going to how to test mesh applaud sensor. Uh, you can see this is a mesh applaud sensor and uh, this is ECU uh, tester. And it is with the IU uh, Camry Camry ECU and uh, to check the phone diagnostic trouble post and uh, database IU uh, control thin bro. When ECU have a rock bump and about a mesh airflow sensor, you use a canton and reach the trouble code. You can, as you can see, a mesh airflow sensor circuit flow in both, airflow sensor circuit high in both, and trouble charge airflow sensor to handle the trouble. Uh, you can do ECU tester and simulate sensor and chat uh, for post inside ECU. And now I talk about uh, function uh, pin. Function pin now uh, match airflow sensor. Uh, which Toyota uh, match airflow sensor of Toyota have uh, five pin. Uh, as you can see, uh, E2, E2 pin, uh, go around. Uh, E2, G, go around. TSA intact temperature sensor signal, uh, P a power a power sensor travel, and VG a mass airflow sensor signal. Uh, you can do uh, ECU tester and uh, simulate sensor on a vehicle. And after you simulate sensor, uh, you do a canton and uh, see a data list mass airflow sensor. And then you compare this value at ECU tester. Now I connect ECU tester and ECU. Uh, firstly, I connect ECU with power. Then I connect ECU uh, with the cathode. And next, I uh, connect a mesh airflow sensor signal VG, VG to mesh airflow sensor at ECU tester. Uh, when you test a uh, mesh airflow sensor on a uh, vehicle, and you Find a connector mesh airflow sensor and you uh, disconnect the uh, connector and then you find a EPG. Uh, you, you find EPG as a connector and you connect, connect with the uh, EPG connector. And uh, now I have uh, zero can to uh, connect with the uh, ECU and I select the mesh airflow sensor. Match applause sensor uh, and then I, I simulate match applause sensor and then I change the value as uh, ECU tester. Uh, when I change the value, I see uh, the match applause sensor value as ECU tester. Uh, you can see uh, LCD, it's like a uh, match applause sensor signal. And then you combine uh, with the match applause sensor as uh, cartoon. When you change the value, match airflow sensor, uh, but uh, match airflow sensor at can to not change, uh, you can lose uh, match airflow sensor function from inside ECU have a problem. Now I show uh, you how to connect uh, match airflow sensor on vehicle. And you, you reconnect, uh, you disconnect uh, match airflow sensor, and you find a pin VG or match sensor. And you connect, and then you uh, use a pen tool and uh, reach a data list and combine with the uh, issue data. Um, I think uh, if you have an uh, issue data, uh, you may be easy to check the function mark and processor in the ECU. And if you are not uh, have issue data, you, uh, you can use a mesh app log. You can use a mesh app log to simulate mesh app log signal and to check the ECU. Uh, if you have questions about how to test uh, mesh airflow sensor and how to match the uh, cable uh, card for test ECU, uh, you can contact with me. Thank you for watching video.